What is going on beautiful people? My name of course is Logix. Welcome back to another Madden Mobile 25 video on the channel. This video of course is presented by the EA Creator Network. If it wasn't for those beautiful people over there, I can do the things I do over here. And we've got an absolute banger for you today. It is 25 all pro packs versus 25 Madden packs. Which is going to come out on top? which one's going to provide the most epics and hopefully some iconics along the way. If you're new to the channel, I recommend subscribing. If you do enjoy the video, leave a like. It does help me out. And of course, comment your thoughts down below. So let's get into it. As you can see, I've got quite a few packs stocked up. We've got about 50 in total. And of course, it's 25 split between the two. I'm very excited in this one. Uh, let's just quickly remove all of those out of there. Beautiful stuff. Turn the volume down a little bit as well. And this one should be be good so let's get into it i kind of wanted to go through like like for like but i feel like it's easier to have a tally at the end of it if you just go piece by piece so let's start off with what is most likely the all pro packs as you can see here now the new pack animations as i've said many times it are absolute bangers and you know you're going to end up hitting something if you see that gold or that purple so let's get into it pack number one not too good two uncommons but of course these packs contain uncommons and these are the cheaper ones out of the two so you're going to get a little bit more bang for your buck if you do end up hitting something extra special we're going to see two rares not too bad at all i'll take it you get a kinlaw and a levi wallace as well let's jump into pack number three we're going to try and do this in a reasonable amount of time but of course if we hit something extra special we're gonna to have to take a moment and pause for that one and just see what we can do pack number four what's it gonna be i want to at least see i want to at least see maybe one epic out of the all pro packs if we do hit that i'll be very very happy but if we don't we don't i'm gonna skip the animation on that one let's try the animation on this one though Nothing. You're going to see when you drop into it that you're going to see those lights drop down from the top. So you're either going to see the purple or the gold if you're going to hit something extra special. But of course you can still hit rares in these, which is always useful right at the start of the season. And this one's going to be a cheeky rare punter, Tory Taylor. I'm also going to get a Jonathan Greenard as well there. Let's continue on. Pack number eight. No time to mess around. Is it going to be good? It's not. We're going to skip that. It's going to be a rare and an uncommon as well. Pack number nine, we're not even halfway yet, but I feel like something is cooking. And it is! We get a Cali Mac! I don't mind it, I don't mind it. Cali or Mac, of course, Cali Mac, however you want to say it, whether it's a nickname or not. Either way, it is the Mac. I like it, it's the return of the Mac. Linebacker, not too bad at all. That is our first epic for the all pro pack. So right now, they've got a tally of one, which is absolutely stupendous. Nine out of 50, we've still got a long way to go. Hopefully, we're going to pull a lot more along the way. Can it be back to back? Now, that would be ideal if we do indeed hit something. Not today, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to hit a rare, though, and an uncommon. Uncommon. Not bad, not bad. Pack number 11. So we're coming up for about halfway through the all pro packs. We're going to hit another epic. Matthew Stafford. I actually need a quarterback. That is a really good pull. I mean, in like the grand scheme of it, obviously you want to see an iconic, but for me, I haven't got a quarterback right now of any stature. So I'll take a Matthew Stafford. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. It's always good. I mean, we didn't hit a back-to-back, -back, but we almost did. I mean, it feels like we kind of did, but we didn't. You know what I mean? Let's see. Okay. <laughs> okay. I just said we didn't hit a back-to-back. -back. Then they were like, no, don't worry about it. We're going to give you a back-to-back -back anyway. I'll take it. Devin Lloyd as well there from the Jaguars. I don't mind that. I don't mind that. Very, very nice indeed. The Jags looking rather tasty there. That's three epics on the board for the All-Pro Pack. But of course, if we hit an Iconic maybe in the Madden, it might end up sort of swaying it in terms of the winner's circle. But I don't mind it. I don't mind it. Let's go again. Pack number 13. We got about, what is it, 12 to go? 12 to go and three epics? I don't mind that. That's a good total to have. Gonna skip that one. There you go. Not bad, not bad. Another rare there. I don't really want to count the rares and the uncommons. For me, it's more about the epics and the iconics. But, uh, you know, you never know. You never know. I mean, it's always good to see a few rares. Obviously, the base on this is two uncommons and it goes up from there. But uh, I'm yet to see, from memory, an iconic from an all-pro. 
but I have certainly seen an Iconic from a Madden. So I'm hoping that the second batch of packs is really going to be where it's cooking. But value for money wise, the All Pro pack is coming in kind of clutch. Three epics so far. And we're now on pack number 18. I'd like to see maybe four epics. Like that would be good. We get a new one there as well. Gypsum. Xavier Gypsum. Not bad, not bad. Or Gypsum. Gibson, Gibson. You know the pronunciation's not always going to be on point for me. I can only apologise for it. But it's not bad. Five of these left. Let's see. We're almost halfway there, baby. I don't mind it. I don't mind it. Show me possibly something special. Four of these left. Can we hit an Iconic from an All Pro? Can we hit our fourth Epic? That would be ideal. Instead, we're going to hit a new one. It's going to be Austin. Austin Corbett, I think that was as well. Let's go into number 22. It's not going to be a lucky 22, but maybe 23 is where the magic happens. I don't mind it. I don't mind it. Ah, okay, maybe not. Maybe not. We're hitting a few uncommons now. The run had to uh, go downhill eventually, unless this one's going to hit differently. No, nope, but pack number 25 is where it's got to be at, right? The final all pro pack before we jump into the Madden packs. Maybe, just maybe, this one's the one. Not today, ladies and gentlemen. Not today. But it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Let's go into pack number 26. The first Madden pack. We hit three. But of course you're going to hit three. It's going to be three rares. It's not going to be anything else other than three rares. Now, I do believe for these ones, it's going to be rare and above. So, of course, the chances should be a little bit more in your favor. And it's one epic already. Pack number two. Matthew. Don't mind it. Don't mind it. Tyron Matthew. Don't mind that at all. Safety, I believe that is. Yes, indeedy. Don't mind it. So, three epics for the All Pro in total. We've got one epic already in only our second pack here from the Madden packs. So the All Pro wasn't too bad. But I'm hoping, I'm hoping this is where it goes crazy. I want to see a big, big boy poll. There you go. Epic number two. It's going to be a Stroud. Don't mind it at all. Don't mind it at all. We're now reigning with quarterbacks. I'm surprised, man. I'm surprised. We had Stafford, and now we're going to get Stroud in there as well. So currently, Madden Packs have got two epics, and we managed to get three in total from 25 All Pros. But if we hit an Iconic, it might be lights out, and it might be a clear winner. But I'd say, at least for value for money-wise, the All Pro did hit very well. I don't mind it. Drew Dalman as well there. Okay, so it's free for free. Free for the Madden packs. Free for the All Pro. Now, anything from here with 18 packs left is going to be gold dust. There's no doubt about it. But it's whether it's going to come in a little bit more clutch. Imagine if we have a dry spell from the moment when we hit those three. We're not going to. I don't even know why I'm even saying it. Jeffrey Simmons, DT from the Titans. I don't mind that at all, baby. That's very, very nice indeed. Very, very nice indeed. Let's go in again. So what's that? Four epics now? Five epics. All right, we're going to go back to back to back. Matthew Stafford. They said anything you can do all pro, Madden packs can do better. And that's fine. What's that now? Three for three? That's four? That's, that's crazy. And that's five. I think I've just lost count there just out of excitement. But I think that's five, right? That might just be five. I might need to double check. <laughs> but I believe it's five. Don't judge me for the miscounting. You know, there's a lot of packs to go through, so I might just be losing the plot. But it's fine, it's fine. That one's going to be just nothing but rares. 13 left. We yet to see an Iconic out of this, but it could change very, very quickly. Nothing to write home. It's fine. We're going to skip it. Going into pack number 38. So we're certainly more in favor right now, I think, in terms of the amount that we've picked up. I mean, obviously, the Madden pack has come in a little bit more clutch. We've still a lot more to go, but... You never know. You never know. Maybe, just maybe, an Iconic is waiting for us. Ten left. Ten left. Okay, look, I'll say it once, I'll say it again. It's, it's crazy, and that's even better. It's a DK Metcalf, man. I needed another wide receiver. This one has certainly paid out good to me. I don't mind it at all. What's that, six now? I think that's six. So, we're basically double. We're double what we managed to get from the All Pros. But I'm not going to turn around and say the All Pros weren't too bad. Because they were certainly pretty good for what we got. But let's just see. Nine left. Nope. Is there going to be an Iconic? I want to see that gold. I want to see it rain gold. Show me. 
No, not today, man. Not today, but it's fine. Eight more to go. It's absolutely a okay. We're going to get there. We're going to get there. Maybe this is the one. No! No! I don't know. Even the epics are starting to run out. Even the epics are starting to run out. What are we on? Three for the all pro? Six for this, most likely? Let's see. Continue it on. Five left. Five left. I think it's safe to say that Madam Pack's going to take the victory, but it would be nice to see something a little bit extra on top of that as well. I don't know. Maybe, just maybe. I mean, roughly, ratio-wise, that's pretty good. I take it back. Seven. It's got to be seven now. Jeffrey Simmons again. That's another epic, but it is a duplicate. We've got three left. Can you show me the iconic? Come on. Not in this one. Not in this one, but it's fine. It's absolutely fine. 48 out of 50. Might even be a little bit of last, last pack magic. I don't know. I don't know. That one didn't have it, but this is roughly coming in for the last one in just a moment. Come on. No. Okay, so we're on three and seven. This is officially the final one. Show me something spectacular. I'll be very happy indeed. Come on. Come on. It is another epic. It is another epic. What's that? Eight. And Xavier McKinney as well from the Green Bay. Don't mind it at all. Ladies and gentlemen, I do say at the end of this, the Madden Pack has taken the crown. There's no doubt about it. We didn't hit an Iconic in this one, unfortunately. But it was a good battle. Nevertheless, so if you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe if you're new here, comment forward down below, and I'll catch you in the next one. Ta-ta, adios, bye-bye.